That sure is a lovely view of the ocean. Too bad nobody's here to see it. Oh, wait a second. There we are, all five of us. Me, Drippy, Swain, uh, Marcuson, and P. It's running around with us out here, I tell you. I don't know how safe that is, but anyway. Hey, guys, Nintendo Capri Zone here. Welcome back to Let's Play Nino Cooney. Uh, apologies in advance if I sound a little weird. I'm using a new mic. A Blue Yeti. Yes, indeed, I am. So, that's that. And if all goes well enough, I think I'm going to keep using it. In the meantime, let's get in a fight. Because I'm going to start a fight. Hell yeah, um... So one thing I didn't mention is that when you're on this island, it's probably a good idea to do a lot of stealing. And I gotta tell you, if there was one thing that I could change about this playthrough right now, it would be that I would do more stealing, that I would have done more stealing throughout the game. Do you guys want to stop and give me a chance to do something here? Good lord. I'm just trying to put in a command, man. Is this such a crime? Holy shit, I'm almost dead. Uh Let's get out of here. Yeah, let's get out of here. What the heck happened there? This wasn't even healed up for that or nothing. I noticed it in between like when I was oh boy. Well, you know what? It's, it's a good thing that worked because that would have really sucked if it hadn't. Look at us we're all out of magic and everything. Yeah, as I said, I spent a little time in between videos grinding on this island. Not just grinding levels, most, but more like grinding steels with Swain. Because there are a lot of good steels you can get here. And so it's definitely worth the time. You know, especially if you're into the whole alchemy thing. You want to get good items a little bit earlier than you might normally get them. This is definitely the place to do that. And here's what else you can do. If you go over here to the Talking Stone, go to Creature Compendium and look at Habitat, you can search by area to find all the monsters you ever wanted to look for. So if you want to see all the monsters that inhabit a certain area, like Nazca, for example, which is where we currently are, you can look at every single one. And if you look on the right side of the screen, it'll show every single thing that they can drop. Like, this guy drops a big Bavana, Power Stone, and whatever they drop is also what you can steal from them. So as you can see, you steal Star Crystals from these guys, which I could have used before. Steal Crown Berries from them, that's really good. Uh, mainly you want to steal Star Pearls, because those are really good. You can get them from this Sheep guy here. And you can get Meteorite Fragments from this guy. So as you can see, he also has a Rare Drop. Like, whatever, whatever item is third down on the list of items dropped is the rare drop. But, um, Swain can also steal rare items, although it's, as, a, as you can imagine, it's pretty rarely that it happens. So one trick that I've actually read somewhere is that if you set the AI to do nothing and just have your party constantly defend... You can wait out a gold limb to appear. We can do this! Because you'll get nice for defending. And so eventually, if you do it enough times, a gold glim is supposed to appear. You pick up the gold glim with Swain, and he does his little overdrive move, which in his case is always stealing the rare item. So I haven't tried that yet myself. So I can't vouch for whether or not it actually works or not, but it's just something to keep in mind. This is a little awkward. I'm kind of leaning towards my mic because it's on my desk. But my TV's in, like, a different direction. Ooh, Seeds of Discord. That's another good drop. Did I get any of those? I don't even remember. So anyway, so what I want to do now is kind of take a look here. And see if I can make some stuff out of the junk that I picked up here. For one thing... Okay, guys, well, never mind. Apparently, I wasn't thinking there. I needed three tack stones for that particular formula. And I only have two. So what I'm going to do is try a different one here. That is one tack stone, two jade marbles, and three ember stones. So I don't have any of those. <laughs> 
Let me actually see what this makes. I think it's the Rainbow Lance, but I'm not sure. Yeah, it is. Hey, how about that? Okay. Question is, can anybody actually equip that, though, as a thing? Yeah, you can, but it's not as good as the Dragon Lance. The Dead Eye Spear, is it even as good as that? Ooh, it is as good as that, okay. It's only slightly better than the Dead Eye Spear, but it's better, so. Here's one here, there's one more here that I should be able to make. And that is, um, because I picked up some Blizzard Blooms, actually, from some draw points out on the uh, Frozen Continents. So, we're going to do two of those. Two Whetstones, there they are. It took me a minute to find them. <laughs> like an idiot. And three spring waters. Yes, indeed. What do we got here? I don't even remember what this is going to make. Oh, a set of ripple robes. That's probably not as great as I think. I just suppose it's worth a look. Ooh, it is, actually. By quite a bit. We'll do that then. Yeah, why not? Who else wears robes around here? You got mystic robes. We actually could have stolen wizard robes from Shadar if I thought to do that in the fight, but I never did. Which is really too bad, because <laughs> that sure would have been nice to have. It's a really good item. It's not too late, though. We can still make it. And those of you on the left side of the aircraft, if you look out your windows, you can see a place called Turtle Crag. It is the place that Tim forgot to visit in his Nino Cooney LP, famously, all those years ago. It is a place where you can grind rumble nuts, but even more importantly, it has a forest glade that he never visited. Now, folks, I'm changing the past by visiting it, so... See, there's a purple chest here that I never got. You visit here. Excuse me, you visit here, you want something? Or you want play? I am playing, man. You want play with me? Play with me! Let love and start, let love and start. That's why I used to think as a kid in the song Hold Me Now. I thought he was saying play with me. Enigma armor, what? I've been missing that all this time? Don't tell me. I mean, if this turns out to be something really good, I'm gonna kind of be mad at myself. Well, accuracy 120, defense 278. I say that's better. Oh, it's an ingredient too, is it? What can you make with it? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna look it up real quick. Hang on a second. Friggin' blow pipes, man. You don't get those till the final dungeon, but you need them for everything. Jeez. Fine, then be that way. You new face, wanna play with me? Let love and start, let love and start. You know what I'm gonna do? Let me chart chest this real quick just to make sure there's not like a green chest here somewhere. Cause if there is, I don't wanna miss it. Here, why don't we, why don't we just look at the map? There is a green chest here. Tried to fool my ass, huh? Don't lean too far back from the mic there. I don't know, I'm kind of hoping that maybe if, if I get some distance from the mic once in a while, that'll be okay. Because at least then it'll kind of make you feel like you're more in the room with me, sort of. That's kind of what I'm going for there. Although, really, I don't know how. Right, where's the spot? Now, does it have to be... Okay, here we go, here we go, I found it. Right over here, right, right there. There it is. It's right on top of the rock there. Ah, oh, thank you so much. Boom! Just like that. Yeah, slowpoke gem. Hardly worth it, but... Yeah, at least we picked it up, right? So that's one more area that I never visited. We got that out of the way. There's actually another area that had a red chest in it that I never picked up. It was like another one of these glades on an island like this, but... I could have sworn I'd visited them. Actually, I think I know where it is. 
I don't want to go too far out of my way for this because it's because it couldn't possibly be something that great. I want to say it's right over there on this island here. Because there really doesn't seem to be anything else here. You know, there's no draw points. There's hardly any monsters. But there, I'm pretty sure there was a glade here. And if there is, we could just... Dude. Then we could just do this thing. So yeah, it's right here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, this whole little area here. This is, like, really big, actually. You know from here? Hello, welcome! I don't know, I don't know what's going on here. This looks important, though. This fairy, not good with girl, not good at all. Really? That is beautiful, you're ten times more lush than any girl from Tahiti. Mind you, there's only one girl there, and that's my ma'am. But still, you properly charmed me, you have. I've gone so weak at the knees, it's a miracle I'm still standing. So, got any plans tonight, then? I know some cracking jokes I do. Ah, uh, stop right there. What are these guys doing here? <laughs> Top drawer. This is the slapstick. To slaps a guy we did that quest for. Oh, really? Well, first let me check out the chest, because that's what's really important here. Toadstool Sunday, well, that's something. A little magical defense next time I feed my familiars. Televisions. Box is telling you many things with many, many visions. Oh, yeah, that's that's something. Uh, yeah, it's true. <laughs> yeah, this place is not bad at all. <laughs> I suppose we should chart chest this one too, though, just to make sure. You never know where they're going to try to sneak in green chests in there. Yeah, like, see, well, well, holy crap, there was one right here that I didn't even see. What the hell is wrong with my ass? This ought to be good, then. Beast hide cloak, yeah, yeah. I can dig it, and there's a green chest here, too. It's right above my head. Whoa, I just hit it. There it is, right there. Yes. Ready, Ready set, aim, and fire. Pouch of Phoenix Breath, yeah, nice. That was actually more worth the visit than I thought it would be, actually. <laughs> Alrighty then, so are we ever going to get back to that continent and finish exploring? Well, I don't know, dude. Because, to tell you the truth, a bunch of new side quests have opened up at this point in the game, and so I'd kind of... Well, we're, we're going to go back to the continent, because that's what I said I was going to do. But still... Yeah, we'll get around to that. We'll get around to the side quest, though. I've done enough side quest crap for a while. Well, I don't know, though. It's been nothing but plot for a while here. Maybe there was some side quest stuff, and I just... Wasn't thinking. Well, not really. I mean, I guess there was... Uh, oh, for crying out loud. Okay, then. Let's finally just go ahead and make this walk. See if we can't at least get this place established as a travel destination, if nothing else. Have we even seen most of these enemies? I don't think we've seen this guy. He's just way too flamboyant to have not seen yet. It's Weaver Diva. <laughs> Let's do it. See, at this point, I pretty much already, like... Conditioned myself to go straight to Swain and steal. And I failed to steal something, but that's okay because you can just try it again. Oh, that's all that's left? <laughs> yeah, I sure took him out real quick. Oh, cheeseburger, wow. That was rather quick. Yeah, quick win! <laughs> Didn't even have to do any of that, you know. That multi targeting cut loose or any of that crap either. So there's one right there. It's really weird looking. I spent so much time going back and forth on here trying to steal stuff. 
I honestly thought I had more tack stones than that. I guess I should have at least looked up who to steal those from. And gotten a few of them. Because I didn't know I was going to need so many. It's another draw point here on this island, but make sure you don't miss this one. <clears throat> oh, you know what I haven't done yet? You know what I haven't done yet? I haven't done Seek Fortune on this island yet. I never did it for the rest of the world either, to be to be fair. Let me see, how many have I missed? There was one right there where I landed. Let me start over and get these. Oh my god, yeah. I'm gonna do that. Okay, so apparently according to the thing, it's right there at the head. Yeah, bottle of Sprite Dew, alright. Oh, just in time before the effects wore off. So we'll go ahead and see with the second one. We're not rewalking all this again, or are we? I don't know. It's such a pleasant experience to walk in this game. <laughs> you wouldn't think it would be, but well, what I tell you. Okay, so right up here in these woods, apparently we got something here. Next to a pond. No, oh, you want some of this? He wants it. Oh no, Necromancer's mantle. I don't know, dude. Paleo lift. I've never Swing. seen one of those. Hey, hang forward. on. Let me get that guy. Paleo, let's see what he's got. Oh, poison be gone? Really? That's it? Alright, well. Word of advice once you've stolen from an enemy, don't bother to try to steal from them again because they won't let you do it twice. You know, in some games you can do it like Final Fantasy X, you can do it multiple times, but no. Not in this game. Get him. There we go. Okay, so Necromancer's Mantle. Who would that be? That's another piece of armor, though, isn't it? Or another one of those soft armor types, like this. 237 and 91. Ooh. That's another one of those where it's like huge physical defense, but no magic defense. Also renders knockout attacks ineffective, though. Uh, it kinda makes you wonder. I don't know. Well, she doesn't have any magic defense on this armor anyway, so... Wouldn't be so bad. Oh, well gee, that's even better than... Never mind then, okay, alright. Who's got the... here, you got a dust mantle. Is that better than what you have? Yes, it is. Huge boost to his evasion, too. I knew somebody would be able to make use of that. Looks like we can just walk right over here. Man, it's too bad we can't walk across there. So we'd be at the end already. As you can see, there's a castle right there. Or is that down there? No, there it is. White Stag's Antler. Is that not a weapon? I think it is. Oh, 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 man, are you kidding me? Oh, new weapon for land? That's fantastic. That is fantastic. And let me let me check something else. I know I keep going in here, but I need to... Okay. I wanted to see if it was an ingredient. But, uh... <laughs> unfortunately, it's not. So this is definitely worth doing. If you forgot to have this, don't. <laughs> don't forget... Harrow Fang at the bottom of the waterfall there. That's not too terribly useful, but uh, it's something. I wonder if there's a... Jeez, that guy just came after me like nothing, man. The guys are putting up a decent fight around here, I will say. Well, it was worth a look. There might be something over there. I, mean, I don't know. It's... I keep leaning back away from the microphone. I'm not sure. <laughs> well, I'm not too familiar with this thing yet. I gotta pay attention and see, like, how much I can get away with as far as leaning back away from it. Wait, wait. Here we go. An all-seeing eye. Ooh, those are hard to come by right there. It's like they're good for alchemy, but you need like five of them to make anything. So. And you also need, like, other stuff. 
man. I tell you. I was gonna fight that thing, but then it's like I realized we're getting pretty high up there on the the old timer. Like I'd be surprised if I'm not up to 40 minutes already, to be honest. You can even see on the map the little emblem. The guy with the shield. Looks a little peculiar if I do say so. So was that everything? That was all of them? No, there's no more. I mean, yes, there's no more. Whoa, wait. I see a question block. What could it mean? Find out next time on Let's Play Nino Cooney. See you guys later.